I'm just at the left side of the property, approximately uh, one metre from the hot water system heading toward the front of the home, and I'm just working my way down this inspection opening here. Okay, so the drain is holding a little bit of water here, uh, all the way along. I'll just work my way through the drain. Let's see. Uh, okay, I'll just work my way through the drain, see where it leads. We are holding a little bit of water uh, through this section. Okay, so it looks like we do have a little bit of back foot from here, working towards the rear of the property. Um, okay, first junction here at two metres. I believe this would be from the main toilet. And just working my way along. Okay, so we are holding water. Okay, I've got a bit of rubble here that I'll just push through. And there is water holding here. I'm just going to pause the video for a moment and uh, see, if I see what's going on. Okay, so we've got an interesting turn of events. We're underwater here at this point at 6.1 metres. We're right back from where I started at the beginning. Uh, there seems to be some sort of a backfall on the drain. Uh, we come out of the drain at this point here. I'm just going to work my way back here. Yeah, so it, the drain seems to be holding water at that point at 6. Point up till about 7.1 metres. We're still holding water, but as you can see, the camera is just coming out of the water slightly. So we've definitely got a negative fall on the drain. But the interesting thing is, okay, so we've got a junction here, I believe, yeah, it's 7.7 metres. A junction, as far as I can tell, is okay. But we've definitely got this, oh, we're definitely holding water. Uh, but the interesting thing is that I initially suspected that there was something that it would be from the actual blockage. But as we proceed along, we actually come up out of the water and we've got a crushed section of pipe right here uh, at 10.5 metres. Um, so basically I can't push past the section, but where this pipe is crushed we seem to come up out of the water. So I'm just going to um, locate where this cross section of pipers and we'll go from there. Okay, so I've just done a sign location. We're approximately uh, three meters to the left of the right hand boundary fence and three meters toward the front of the property from the rear boundary fence. Uh, we're directly under grass. According to that, it's showing a depth of only 25 centimeters, which appears fairly shallow, although the property does kind of slope in that direction. I'm just going to open the boundary inspection now which is approximately two meters or so downstream of this and I'll just see what's going on at the boundary inspection. 